it's time for another wild time to let you know where we're at and what we're up to. We are in Arizona and it is late April, so the temperatures have been hovering in the mid to high 90s. <laughs> yeah, it's been pretty warm here and that works out really well with our broken air conditioning. <laughs> yeah, it's been, been quite hot and uh, we do have another air conditioner and that keeps up, I guess, fairly well. I mean, it keeps us alive, but uh, we prefer to have the other one. Uh, running. Not quite sure yet what uh, is going on with it because when it's like triple digits on the roof, it's not very comfortable to get up there and take all that apart and look at it, especially when we can get by with our other main air conditioner. But this one really helps a lot. So we're going to try to figure out what's wrong with it. It seems to come on uh, the compressor that is and make a <laughs> noise and it, it you know nothing bad no bad noises other than the absence of the the fan I think yeah. is what we're yeah. guessing it is is that the fan has uh, has died yeah. and we're, we're going into eight years now with this yeah. so uh, it, it's done its job uh, we're quite happy with uh, how well, how long it's lasted but <laughs> I'll get up there um, pretty soon and have a look at it. Yeah, we're going to be heading north here, so we'll get into some cooler temperatures that'll make that a little bit easier to do. Um, we're gonna be heading up to the Pacific Northwest. There's some places in Washington that we have visited before, but it was a long time ago, so we would like to revisit those and some new places as well. Uh, places like the Olympic National Forest, we'd really love to go back and yeah, uh, see that. Yeah, we've enjoyed our time park. there and this is gonna be a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. Our travel route to get to the Olympics is going to be uh, much different than we would prefer. We're planning to ride across the open, barren <laughs> desert of Nevada. And nothing <laughs> against Nevada, but that is, there's nothing out there yeah. that we need to see at this <laughs> point. <laughs> yeah, we would much prefer doing a more scenic route that was maybe a little more miles, had some uh, more interesting things to see, but Unfortunately, with the fuel costs uh, that they are right now, it's just not making sense for us to do that. Even the cost of things like DEF has gone up 50%. Yeah, that's the diesel uh, admission fluid. You know, yeah, that so we everything to have. has gone up. Even the the price of you know RV parks and campgrounds, everything is much higher. So this is going to be a more direct, <laughs> less mileage route. <laughs> yeah, a couple of years ago, we remember paying two something a gallon uh, for our fuel. And now, uh, currently we filled up today at uh, almost $5 a gallon, but that's actually considerably lower than even the route that we'll be taking. The, the routes to, to head up that way could cost anywhere from about $6 a gallon to over eight yeah, yeah so it's, yeah, it's pretty expensive very expensive <laughs> so once we get up to the olympics and some of the other areas that we'd like to visit up there we'll be sure to share some adventurous videos with you we also plan to work on some of our seminars and teachings and and that type of thing we've recently been getting an uptick in requests so we'll be working on that as well up in that area and we're gonna also be working on some more merchandise, some adventure and travel saying t-shirts and sweatshirts, different things like that. So we're looking forward to getting those uh, available. Yeah, you can grab our logoed stuff that we already have available and something like it will probably still remain, but we wanna make some more uh, widely uh, interesting uh, <laughs> adventure type uh, graphics and sayings and things like that. We've been sitting on some ideas for quite a while and so we'd, we'd like to take some time to put those together for you too. And we just absolutely love uh, reading your comments and we invite you to share anything that pops into your mind uh, about what we've been saying in this video or anything else about our life and travels as full-time RVers. And please remember to share, subscribe, and click on that little notification bell. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching. This is an interesting little desert playground. Very, very solid. It's supposed to be a saguaro cactus, I suppose, for kids to climb on. Another one made into a bench over here. A little lizard and a tarantula and a rattlesnake. Like a 
spider web over there. See that a little bit. Yep. Rocks to climb on. Check out the rock climbing slide. <laughs> it's a slide? Yeah. I guess you'd climb up the steps here and you can slide down the side. Do it. <laughs> um, no. <laughs> okay. All right. And there's the swing set. How quaint. Very cute. 